All right, guys, I'm going to do a review on these Anchor Step Outhouse Blinds. Uh, it's pretty early in the morning. I'm going to go set one up before i got to start my schoolwork. We're uh, quarantined and virtual right now, so i got a little bit of free time in between a couple classes i got to do. But uh, i got one right here in the truck, and uh, they come in like a little bag with straps on it where you can carry it in the woods like a backpack. So, um... comes in this little thing that you can just fold it up and put it in it's got these little straps that you can carry it like a backpack in or on so i'm gonna go down here and set one up for y'all i set one up yesterday in a shooting lane and i'm gonna set this one up in the corner of a bean field for bow season so uh, i'm gonna show you all that and see what y'all think about them So I don't know how well y'all are going to be able to see, but uh, I just put it on my back with them little straps and got on the four-wheeler and drove in here with it. But uh, it's kind of like a drawstring kind of deal right here where you open it up at the top and you just slide your blind out. And uh, you just kind of catch it wherever there's supposed to be two little rings if it don't really matter and you just let it fold open and uh it just opens up and then in that little black bag that they give you to use to carry it around has got um four little ropes for wind tie downs and six stakes to hold it to the ground so uh i'm gonna get over here and clear a spot out for it and cut a couple limbs and then uh show y'all how to do all that All right, guys, so we always have a bunch of deer come out, like, right in there. And uh, back a couple years ago during bow season, I cut down a little tree right here, and I had my back up against it, bow hunting with a crossbow. And a deer walked out right there and come to the corner of them beans, but I couldn't move because she was staring at me. And I was sitting right there. And uh, I couldn't have killed her no way because she had two phones with her with spots on them. So, anyway... But I got all this little ground cleared out right here. And I'm going to set the blind up right here. And I cleaned out all them limbs so I could see on out in the field. So I'm about to put the stakes in this and put a couple of the tie downs on it. So uh, I'm going to do that and then get back with you. All right, guys, I got the stakes in. And uh, I didn't record that because it's pretty self-explanatory. Three go right here. Three go back there. Um, I put my door back here you open it right here and uh i'm gonna put me like a metal folding chair and a, like a bipod or something here but you can open these windows however you want i don't figure i'm gonna be shooting at a these two windows on the side so i'm probably just gonna open this one like that or something which well i'm probably just gonna keep that one closed because that's nothing but woods right there but uh probably gonna open this one like this just because i don't figure to be shooting much out of there but if a deer starts to walk from out there i'll be able to see it from this window and i can kind of give myself a little bit more room because these zippers are pretty quiet um you can just zip it up in the middle and zip that one to the middle and zip that one to the middle but uh it won't let you zip past the middle on either one. That's why you got to zip them to the middle. But uh, then I'm just going to open this one like this right here, most likely. And uh, just sit there and hunt out of it like that. But uh, anyway, I'm going to put me a metal folding chair and some kind of 
gun rest in here to hunt this one. And uh, if I got time before I go do my school work, I'll go down there and show you where I got the other one. All right, guys, so this is the other place I put out one. There's a little road that runs back there, but I ain't ran it in forever. So it's probably all grown up. But uh, I got this shooting lane out here, and there's actually another blind way down there that y'all seen me hunt before. Yeah, y'all see it right there. This is just the other end of it because that blind's rotted. And there's actually a house, like, right there. So, uh, I can't, it's not really safe to shoot back that way. So I put the blind here to shoot back that way. And I got a camera on that pine tree there and a camera on another tree down there. And uh, I've got a couple bucks in here and a bunch of does. And, uh, I'm gonna clean some of that out back there because there's another road back there and I can catch them crossing down there too. And that's why I put it here so I could see here. And most of the time the deer come from them woods. So I could see off in the woods good here. I can clear out there. And I can shoot down the lane right here. So uh, anyway. I got about five or ten minutes before I got to be on an online class. So I got to go to the house. But uh, anyway, y'all subscribe and I'll catch y'all on the next one.